Hey everybody, it's Alex. I thought I would update from my iPhone. Well, actually, it's not an iPhone. It's more an iPod Touch. Um, uh, yeah, so uh, several things have kind of come up. One of them is I uh, finished applying to grad schools finally, and so now they're all in. Um, so I feel good about that. I applied to three of them. Um, and uh, one... Uh, one I've yet to apply to, uh, but the application's not due until February, so, yeah. Um, another thing is I, uh, mm, I've been looking for, um, uh, like, grad assistantships at the places I've, I've applied to, and I hope I get into them. One of them, um, already uploads, uploads the video, or not the videos, the resume you submitted to them and then departments um, contact you about opportunities that they might have if they want you so I hope somebody wants me um, I'm sure I'm sure something will work out but um, I've yet to hear back from any of them all the applications are really due either at the end of this week or um, the, the first of February so um, yeah, uh, I don't know when I'm going to hear back from them officially, but hopefully soon. Um, yeah, so, oh, I have a cold. I don't know if you guys can hear that, but I have a cold. I'm sick. Um, I never really get sick, which is kind of weird. This is the first time I've been sick in, like, a while. Um, but whatever. I was around sick people, so it doesn't really matter. My, my best friend was sick, and then or her mom was sick, and then my... And she was sick, and yeah, so. <clears throat> um, uh, yeah, another news. I spoke at a GSA, my alma mater high school, um, the other day. <coughs> Sorry. Um, and that was really cool. I, I think I mentioned, no, I didn't mention it. I spoke at it, um, like two weeks ago, last week, two weeks, last week, whatever. Um, this week and then last week I spoke at, at the same meeting impromptu, so that was good. Um, but this time I went with my friend, um, who is lesbian identified, so that was pretty neat. Um, we talked. We were there from 2.45 until 6 at night. <laughs> uh, we talked for a while afterward to some people. Um, they actually may be watching this video, so hi, uh, hello. Um, and that was a really good experience. I... I really like doing that. Um, I like doing the outreach thing. I'm actually a very social creature um, when I want to be. I'm very open to people. Um, and I like sharing my experiences with somebody who's interested and kind and respectful. And I really think the people at the GSA um, were that. So um, that was really good. And hopefully um, they'll want us back to talk. I'm not sure if they want us to be semi-permanent fixtures or not, but... Um, the feedback we got, or at least I heard about, were, was positive, and the um, teacher who ran the group um, is really in support of um, us being uh, a resource for her and also the um, the people uh, that we met up with. So that was really nice. Um, let's see. Uh, oh, I've been uh, thinking about. Um, switching my shot doses myself, um, because, um, yeah, uh, I have been noticing that I've been, like, peaking, and then, like, peaking around the first week, and then spiraling, um, the second week, because I do a two-week cycle, so I'm really thinking about, uh, fixing that and doing like 0.25 every week instead of 0.5 every two weeks. Um, I have yet to um, consult my doctor on that. I'm not sure if I should or not. Um, but I kind of want to do that because I, I feel the changes. Like I'm much more emotional my second week towards the end of my shot than I, than I am. <coughs> um, like before or like during the first few days of my shot um and that's kind of problematic for me um 
uh, yeah. And I've also noticed that my moods are, like, I'm way more, like, depressed um, the second week uh, before my next shot than um, the first. So uh, that's kind of concerning. But uh, So I'm going to look into that um, and hopefully figure out something. Uh, uh, I have yet, I need to get new needles uh, because I really, really don't want to use the, the 22 half inch gauge thing because I, I don't know, I just don't. And I, I'm comfortable with what I know, so I'm going to try to look into like something, like purchasing something, like like a needle thing somewhere, um, maybe. Um, and then I switch T vials next time I inject, and that'll be on my, the sesame seed concentration instead of the cotton seed that I have started with. I will let you know if there's any problems. I'm a bit concerned about it, but I'm, you know, that's kind of like, you're used to, you get used to something and then it changes, you know, I'm not really good with that. So that's my anxiety stuff. So um, I don't think it'll matter. I'm not allergic to sesame seeds that I know of. Um, and I think it should be fine. But if any problems arise, I will let you know, you know and my doctor know. Um, so yeah. Uh, another thing is I am pretty sure I have a yeast thing, not infection. It's just on my skin. Um, I posted about it in a live journal community I'm a part of. And I also asked my significant other and my mom about it. And they both kind of, they, everybody really said that I, I mean, it doesn't itch or anything. It's just there. But I've, I tried to like wash it with soap and it's kind of like spread now. So I don't know if, I don't know. I'm going to try cortisone. And also, uh, head and shoulders shampoo and see if that works. Uh, I really don't know what it is. Uh, it might be fungal or yeast or I think maybe, is yeast fungal? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. Um, oh, also another thing. I have reconnected with somebody that I have known for, uh, almost 10 years. Holy crap, that's crazy. I think. A long time, anyway. And, um, they're contemplating transitioning, and they, um, spoke to me about it, and I'm really happy, and, um, I like being a resource. I, I really do like being a resource for people, um, so if anybody ever has questions, um, let me know. That's kind of one of the reasons I put myself out on YouTube, because I like being, like, a resource and available for people, because I know that I watched a lot of people's guys's, a lot of people's guys's, a lot of guys's, um, YouTubes when I was contemplating and it really helped, like, it just really helped. And even though I didn't really always talk to the people that I was watching, I, the information that they provided were, was really, really helpful. So, um, yeah. Anyway, uh, that's really a rant. It's getting, uh, yeah, it's, it's just a rant. So, um, that's about what I'm doing. I'm pretty happy. Um, yeah, I'm pretty happy. So, uh, I hope everybody has a good, um, rest of the week. And if you're getting any snow like I am in the next few days, good luck with that. Um, or if you were in Alaska and got 18 feet, I really hope you're okay. <laughs> so, uh, all right, well, thanks. Thanks for listening. Okay, bye.